fact, we have nothing to worry about. According to our research, the next emission will not occur for at least two months, four days, and seven hours. Its intensity will be three on the Bergman scale, which is 2.13. Without going into detail, I must say I have never seen anything like this before. The encephalogram suggests serious damage to the nervous system, but the other indicators couldn't be better. It's... it's astounding. Perhaps it has something to do with the emission. Most certainly, although so far I've been utterly unable to formulate a rational explanation for this abnormality. Oh, Welcome back to the world of the living, Stalker. How are you feeling? Do you remember what happened to you? <laughs> In the joking mood, eh? That bodes well for your recovery. I'm Lebedev, the group leader, and I'm responsible for everyone here. That includes you, for as long as you're here. We call ourselves Clear Sky. And you are in our base right now. We picked you up in the swamps after the emission. Lucky? Hmm, I doubt it. The facts are these. You survived the emission. That's the first thing I still can't explain. The second thing is that our patrol found you in the swamps, which are essentially endless quicksand. And thirdly, you nearly got torn into shreds by a pack of pseudodons. But our boys got you out just in time. Such a chain of events tells me it's more than just luck. Anyway, I need to finish what I'm doing. So let's continue this conversation later. <laughs> 